you want to see something stupid. Uh, they turn orange. What's good, YouTube fam? It's your girl D, back with the Beauty with D series. Today, today we are actually digging around us with my facial mask and trying something new. So this is the Epeachy hydrating mask that I got in my Ipsy bag, and for the life of me, it's just been sitting there for like three months and I figured you know what hey, let's just go ahead and put it to use see what it's about um, you can get this directly from EPG's website epginternational.com as well as Amazon just recently learned that <coughs> the full size mask the 3.3 ounce retails for $35 this travel size which is one ounce Amazon had it for six bucks as low as six dollars Ipsy is not offering it right now, and I can't say how much um, EPG is offering it for, but I think it's 12, since it's technically a third of the math, I don't know, but anyways, so if you want to see how it, I rocked it and how it worked out for me, stay tuned after the jump. Alright, again, I am coming on camera with the mask already applied. I um, want to make this a quick video since it is kind of late at night. Again, this is, I have no idea how to pronounce it properly, but it looks like a peachy, a peachy. It is a hydrating mask. This is a pretty good solid sized sample, and I actually got this in my Ipsy bag. Um, it is, let's see, this one ounce. It's obviously this kind of a pea green in color. It says, moisten skin with lukewarm water, then apply to the entire face while avoiding these sensitive areas around the eyes. Leave on for approximately 15 to 20 minutes, then with warm water, gently rinse face, wipe off mask residue with a washcloth or a cotton pad, and use once or twice briefly. So, as usual, with any kind of major skin care, you want to make sure that your hair is taken or taken away, <laughs> tucked away. So that you're not you know messing up your edges or anything like that i actually have like you know about a good 25 to 50 11 twists under here i don't think i've been on camera with a twist out so you'll get to see uh miss Seely version of diana anyway so i'm gonna let this dry and actually read up on this mask a little bit while i wait and then i'll come back on camera here in a second Thanks. right you totally wanted to see me laying in bed anyways um, in doing some research on this mask, um, and the description states, Epiche Hydrating Mask is facial mask is a truly invigorating yet gentle way to exfoliate, detoxify, and remove environmental impurities from the skin. Your skin will be left looking brighter and more radiant. Rich in antioxidants, ceramides, and aloe, this cowling clay mask helps to remove dead skin cells and oil while infusing the skin with vital nutrients. Hyaluronic acid is added to help plump, firm, and rehydrate the skin. I do have to say there's definitely some type of firming um, or plumping aspect to it because initially after putting it on, my entire face was tingling. <clears throat> the added benefit of the unique Malus Domestica Swiss Apple Stem Cell Extract regenerates cells to provide a long-lasting effect. So, yeah. Um, it's just about dry. It's not nearly as thick as my regular um, my regular clay masks that I use, and most I just have the Freeman series, anyways. But um, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and wash it off because it really does seem to be dry everywhere. And then I'll give you my uh, final thoughts at that time. Not bad. Not bad at all. Um, yeah. Wow, I'm actually quite impressed. Um, my skin feels soft to the touch. I don't know necessarily if I want to say it feels hydrated. It, with it being a clay mask, it did definitely dry up all of the oil and everything. And you know, I was due for some uh, heavy skincare as it was, anyways. But just yeah, my face is tingling right now. And I don't know if that's the mask or if it's due to the fact that I usually remove my clay masks with this little device here to make sure that I'm getting off all of the residue. Um, but 
I'm not gonna knock it. I mean, I got it for, you know, in, in the Ipsy bag. And also in doing additional research, um, these travel sizes are $6 on Amazon, who's also an authorized uh, retailer or seller for the Apichi brand. Um, and you can get it from their website directly, or you can also get it on Amazon as well, too. So, um, I've got a couple of these, actually, because they were in some Ipsy bags, but for being a clay mask, not bad at all. I'm actually quite impressed with it. Uh, I've got a couple breakouts, unfortunately, but that's why I wanted to go ahead and get a Beauty with D filmed, because we can go ahead and just shut that shit down immediately. And also give you guys something to look at as well too. So um, if you're interested in it or if it works for you, let me know how. Let me know um, in the comments section what it is that you think of it as well. And how it's benefited you if with the suggested once or twice weekly frequency. As always. Sorry. As always, thank you ever so much for watching, liking, commenting, and subscribing. If you have any questions or suggestions, please hit your girl up in the comment section. Please feel free to also subscribe if you haven't already yet. I'd love to see you back on my channel. Check out the other uh, the other playlist. I've got a little bit of something for everybody. Other than that, I will see you on the next video. Take care.